All right. Uh, this gentleman uh, was diagnosed uh, with Stevens-Johnson syndrome uh, approximately 14 years ago, and um, he's wearing a scleral lens right now. And for a period of time, approximately 12 years, he had no functional vision. I'm gonna let him talk. Okay. Um, yes, as I flashed, said about back in 1991, I had allergic reaction to penicillin, uh, which um, later I was diagnosed as uh, having Stevens-Johnson, which led me very unfunctional, heavily visually impaired, um, in fact I couldn't even see the big E, um, and uh, honestly my life was uh, was a very hard life because of the, the discomfort that I had to go through, uh, but through you know the grace of God and my unwillingness to give up I was able to achieve my educational goals and I really was able to step forward in my future and continue to make a life for myself, but um, in 19 what was it, 2004, I think it is, Yeah. my life really changed for the better when I found Dr. Boschnick on the internet. A friend of mine, a co-worker of mine, um, was doing some research uh, on Stephen Johnson and he, and he found Dr. Boschnick here in Miami. Now I'm from Tampa, at the t I'm from Tampa, so, and I was living there. And um, I, I knew about the skill error lens because I went up to Boston and I worked with Dr. Perry up there. However, because of all the distance, I really didn't think, I didn't know what the problem, the diagnosis was going to be for using the Stephen Johnson. So it was such a blessing to know that someone here in Florida uh, was actually knew about the sclera lens and really knew how to treat me. So in 2004, when I came, I was very optimistic. In fact, it was on August 20th, uh, my fiance, now wife's birthday, when we first met him, I was very, very optimistic that this was going to work. Um, he was very caring. And I, I could never really ask for anything more. I mean, this has been a blessing. Um, not only has my sight improved, I'm functional. I have a lot more confidence in myself. I have a driver's license. And um, just, I can never imagine what life was before the skull error lens. And I think a lot of times it is about your doctor, although, you know, the science, the science is there, but you need caring people behind you. You need people who believe in what they're doing. And you need people who believe in you. And I think that, that has all helped me with the prayers and just being around positive people that I can stand today seeing 2040 just now, which I know I can see it better. I did see a little bit on the 2020, but I don't think you'll give me any credit. But anyway, mm -hmm. I mean, just that, um, just being around positive people. And I thank God for Dr. Boschnick and I thank God for what we're doing. And I'm more than satisfied and more than pleased.